Hello sweeties. So this is the second challenge. Still on the curls challenge. And this time round, we're going to be doing it a bit different. Okay, I just want to show you, well, you saw me, it, that was yesterday actually in the video where I did the waves and then I put them up in a bun. I've just taken the bun down, my hair is still dry. So this is what it looks like, close to what I have normal anyway. So what's the difference going to be today? Okay, today we're going to try dampening the hair and then, oh, I've got hair in my, in my mouth, sorry for that. And then I'm going to put in the Lnet three day waves, waves three day, heat protectant and styling spray. Okay, and then I'm going to curl. So let's see if this works better. Right, let's go ahead. Right, I'm going to hold a fair bit away, so I don't want my hair too wet. And I'm starting at the top, moving down. It is now five o'clock in the afternoon so I will have before I go to bed five hours and then the night but as you know my hair takes a long while to dry even if it's just open it takes four five hours so that is why I'm giving it its best chance uh, with more hours shoulder length hair most probably will do with just overnight but I don't trust my hair to dry that quick so I'm giving it double the time okay I think mm -hmm. no, let me just dampen at the back so I've still got bits here that aren't wet Okay, as I said, I don't want it really wet, wet, but I do want some of it wet. Okay, let's brush through this. I didn't bring my paddle brush. I've got to pause. I'm sorry, I forgot my paddle brush. Okay, there we go. I'm back. Right, let's brush through the bottom. This doesn't feel this doesn't feel at all wet. Just give it a tiny spritz. Okay. Okay, I would say this is brushing through 90% dry and some bits a little bit more because I didn't do it exactly evenly. Let's just make sure that there's a bit of wet everywhere. Okay, so obviously it's not going to be complete five hours because it'll take me, well I can't remember how long it took me yesterday, but half an hour to curl. Okay, right, so that's the wetting bit. Oh, I still have very dry bits here. Oh. Still have very dry bits in there. Okay. If you see funny lights, that's because I don't know there's been a lot of ambulances and police going by lately. Um, we did have a stabbing the other day and a major car accident where the road was blocked off for most of the day. 
Um, not that I'm living in a bad area, but sometimes it does happen. Okay, here we go. So I've done the water or aloe first in my case. <laughs> Look how dusty this is. Oh, that's how often I use this. Okay, so now on goes the styling gel. Um, not styling gel, styling. Heat protect and styling spray waves three days. Right, get it right, Maya. Oh, is this actually switched on? Yeah. Okay, that'll go on now too. Okay, let's see if we can get rid of the frizz a bit. Number one with this. And number two, whether the curls actually hold better. Okay. Let's brush this through. It's a bit wetter than I was hoping for. But that's why I'm giving it extra time. overnight okay yeah you see this is now a tiny bit too wet more than I wished for places it's too wet and in others it's not okay let's see if I can brush this through a bit better I'm now switching over to this brush to get it distributed better because the ball bristle in this will distribute this a bit better okay Okay. I'm just trying to get some air into there. Okay. Right, I've made a bit of a mess here. Let me wipe some of this spray that I've sprayed everywhere off. Okay, right. I'm also going to curl a tiny bit different today. Let's see if that works better. So I have here my curlers. They are dry. I am not going to wet them because I have my hair damp. Uh, let's see. I should have opened these before coming on. But I was undecided whether I was going to film this today. But as I have lots to do tomorrow again, my husband is arriving Friday. So, I want to get a few things tidied up and it's been raining so I've got an extraordinary amount of laundry to do. Right, let's get started. Where's my comb? I don't really like combing with my comb. I only like parting. Where's my brush gone? Yeah, here we go. Okay, brush this through. Okay, I'm now going to try a different method. I'm going to start halfway. And 
and I'm going to curl this way. Same pattern, just a different way of curling so that I don't have to stretch my arms so far out. Getting, I'm using my rat tail here just to get the ends in. Okay. Same pattern. of curling. There we go. Now, put that down. Back to the bobby pins. Is that going to flop? I think it will. make it a bit more secure. Okay, right. I want to stay true to the pattern so that it doesn't change that much the pattern. So that one was this way around and this goes upwards. So once again, halfway, and I'm curling it up the other way, making sure the ends go in, not straining my arms as much. I've still got frizz. I think the section of hair might have been a bit big as well. Okay, well we don't have to be perfect. I don't think that in the 40s and 50s or even 30s they were that perfect in their curling either. Right, let's brush this through. This is the same as the other side. This is easier for me to get the tension better as well. Curling this way. Okay, and it's going a bit quicker than yesterday. Right, now I need to check again the back. So I need to wedge up, uh, wedge my mirror a bit. It's not playing today. Come on. Okay, so I, what I'm going to do different is I'm going to take a back piece because the parting was very big yesterday. Okay. All right. Right, that one, I rolled this one forwards, so I'm going to be rolling this one backwards. See if that makes a difference to the frizziness as well. I really want to crack this business, this curling business. Okay. Let me attend to this. This didn't go well, so let me pin that down. Oops, the curler opened, don't want that, and I'll pin this one also down. 
I think because my hair's so long, I have to pin all of these down. Okay, let's just pin that down as well. I can sleep on it so it doesn't really matter. It doesn't feel awkward sleeping on it. Okay. I am going to find a method that will work for my hair and maybe this will help you as well to find your method that's why I'm videoing all of these trials whether they're fails or not so that you can make a choice as well when it gets to your hair which one you think will work for yours best And I think the major problem is that all vintage styles are done with short hair. Did I pin this? Yes, it's just... Okay. Right, so now I'm doing the side bit here. I started that off wrong you see the tension is wrong I'm losing a lot already okay let's start again okay I can't really see where my roller is let me hold it the other way around. Maybe if I do it left-handed. There you go. Okay. Let's try be flexible. Let's hold it with the left hand. Be a bit ambidextrous. Seems like I've got less hair on this side, even though I have the parting on that side. I hope I'm still in the picture. I'm concentrating on the winding. I'm, tr I'm trying to get it as smooth as possible and still to tuck the ends under and yet keep the tension. My tension yesterday was off as well so let's try do this better today. Uh, this one's not going as good. Here we go, we're getting there, we're getting there. All right. Pin that down. Okay. 
side now to the back let's carry on in the back next section it feels actually quite dry now my hair or I would say it is dry right where's No, that wasn't good. Start again. All right, here we go. Yes, I know I'm squeezing the sponge roller, which you're not supposed to do. But with this length of hair, as I said, I don't care if the ringlets are a lot smaller because I'm not sure they'll stay anyway and if it shortens the length of hair then that's only a benefit to me for styling okay oh no not this business again here we go I hope you can see in the mirror behind and I hope I'm going to get this back on now. I don't want to have to unroll it and roll it again. it thank heavens for that all right bobby pin clip it on get it in there all right so I'm left with two two bits now it's not as if I'm running out of rollers I could use more <laughs> I've still got quite a few left. I think I brought in total three packets. I think they came in sixes. I think it was three packets originally. So I've always got quite a few left over. And I have a few unopened ones as well, just in case these get so gacky and unusable that I've got backup plan if I need it. Okay. And the last one. Did I miss this little bit out? I did. I'll just take it over here. I missed a tiny bit. Oh, that's going to be most probably too short to curl anyway. Let's brush this through. Okay. Unconventional way. One's got to adapt. So for those that want an actual authentic 40s vintage look, roll from the bottom, don't roll from the middle as I am doing. I'm adapting to my hair length because I'm finding it difficult. I tried yesterday, but no. That's not going to work for me. And 
let's pin this one down too. Okay, so all pinned. Let's show you the back in case you didn't see that. Okay, it's a little bit better than yesterday. Okay, now I'm going to spritz once more over the top. Actually quite a lot. Right, same trick as yesterday. Hat on. I tell you what, this was a fantastic buy. I only paid a pound twenty. I got it from, yeah, that was an eBay buy. Was it an eBay? Yes, it was an eBay buy. Fantastic. I am so glad I got this. The silkiness of it helps the hair to get to have less frizz and it fits very well with with this kind of thing as well just gives me that extra layer of protection I am determined to crack this curling business, I really am. Let's see if we can make this look a bit prettier. Okay, not that it matters in bed anyway. So I'm tightening this down actually quite tight. Not that I think it would slip anyway because I have the other one underneath. I'm just going to take the loops and tie them once more. But it just gives it that extra bit of firmness so the rollers can't move around. Right, once more. I didn't get that properly. There we go. So, there we go. It went quicker than yesterday. Yay! <laughs> so, we shall see how this one works out. I will see you tomorrow morning. Until tomorrow morning. Hello, viewers. It's in the evening now. It's been eight hours since I've put these up. And I'm going to take them down now because I've decided I don't want to get up early tomorrow morning. <laughs> Getting up before six o'clock is not fun. So I'll take this down now and let's see how it's turned out. Ah, that's if I can get this knot now undone. I did a really good one here. Okay. All right, let's see. <clears throat> okay. Clips, mustn't forget the clips. Okay, starting at the back. I don't know, is it unwinding easier? I'm not sure. Let's see. Uh, I suppose my little wispy ends aren't that easy. Okay, let's see. Okay, there's a ringlet. There's the first one. <clears throat> uh, 
Let's see if this is more promising. Bobby pin. Where's the bobby pin? Where's the bobby pin? There we go. Undo the clip. The other way around. This way. That's it. Okay. I think it is coming off a little easier than it actually did. And it doesn't look quite as frizzy at the ends. Look. The ends don't look quite as frizzy. That's the next one. Oh, let's see. I'm hopeful, guys. I'm hopeful. Let's see. Let's see. Bobby pin. Search for the bobby pin. Here we go. Bobby pin out. That one got caught up a little bit. Let's see. Ow. I've got to demantle this one a little bit. Okay. This doesn't really want to play. Not at the moment anyway. Okay. We'll get it out. Okay. That's the next one. It's not wet and it's got some curl. Can you see that? It's got some curl. Oh, ho, ho. Bobby pin. Bobby pin. Bobby pin. Yeah, I managed to mess this one up a little bit as well. It's always the back ones, isn't it? Okay. That has a bit more frizz, but there is a curl. <clears throat> bobby pin. Did this one have a bobby pin? No, I don't think it did. Okay, here we go. Looks a bit smoother. Although my technique of winding has to improve a little bit. Okay. Okay, it's got a curl. It's not perfect, but it's got a curl. I don't know, is it better than before? I'm not sure. I think the brush out will tell pin. It's definitely not bad. Maybe I didn't get all the... Where's the bobby pin here? I know it's here somewhere. Maybe I didn't get the strands of hair equally um, sprayed. This technique of just pulling it out is actually easier for me than the unwinding. There we go. It seems to be gentler for my hair. Sounds weird, but it does seem to work better. Right, pin. Up. Oh, nope. If I do it this way, there we go.
yeah, this method of just pulling it off seems to work better and then letting it untangle on its own. Excuse my hands in the camera. I just want to lower this down a bit. There you see. Ha 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 ha. It looks, looks a bit promising. That's fireworks guys. I'm sorry. There's fireworks. There's fireworks here from mid-October all the way through to January. People just can't get enough of wasting their money on fireworks here. Even though Guy Fawkes has already passed. And Bonfire Night. They're still wasting their money on fireworks. Right. Does that look a bit promising? And the last one. look at this am I imagining this or does this actually look better than yesterday oh let me just put together my roller the one that I had to take apart to get out okay let's have a see look see I'm going to adjust the camera again I'm sorry guys here you go Okay, let's do the first brush through. Oh, I've still got a bobby pin in my head. <laughs> in my hair, not in my head. There we go. Right, let's see. <laughs> Moment of truth. Oh, it's brushing through nicely. Okay, the ends do have still some frizz. Oh, okay, I'm going to pull this down a bit more. I think... Does this look a bit better than yesterday? I think it does. I think... Stop the ultimate solution. It is look not looking too bad and it's coming together again. You see here? All right. Let's do this side. Let's get this backwards. Yeah, the frizziness at the bottom needs to be tamed a bit. I could put some oil on, but I don't want to right now. Let's brush a bit higher. Oh. The length does make it more difficult to brush, I must admit.
Okay, I need my little stool. I'll step up and have a look. I don't know, is that any better? I can't really tell. Um, one thing I must say, it feels weightier than yesterday, but on first glance, it has a bit more curl here on the front. It has more wave at the back. It has volume. I think it needs a bit more work. I don't think I want to brush this too much, not like with a proper setting lotion. This looks like it won't last. This looks like it won't last um, if I do it, if I brush too much. Uh, maybe give it, well, in, let's just try it out, test try it with this one because this has ball bristle. Let's see what happens. Does this come together or does it brush out? Oh, I don't know. Maybe. It looks like it's brushing up, but if you shake it up, it comes together again. So maybe it is working. I'm finding the ends a bit difficult. It still has a little bit too much frizz in the ends for my liking. I'm not pulling out hair, but it is a bit grabby at the bottom. Let's see. I'm oh, sorry. Am I? Oh god, this camera's now gone wonky on me again. It does actually curl back a bit again. Even if I'm brushing it hard. Okay, guys. I think... This is another half result. As in, it's holding better. Let's see if I push this up a bit. Does a bit more wave come back? Right, let me just have another look. I need to move my stool so that I can actually see myself I know it's odd okay I think okay right um, this is not a bad result it has volume okay maybe I should have done this one a bit more but I think if one uses a bit of teasing then this would definitely come up look a little bit of wave is forming here so it's definitely not a curl curl but there is a wave do you see that can you see that it's definitely a wave I 
Um, well, it's still not quite the Hollywood look, but we're getting there. Okay, uh, there's more volume. There is definitely a pattern of wave, but it's not quite to the standard where the waves stay put enough, but they're definitely there. Look, if you shake it up, they're there, but not quite strong enough. So we're getting there. This was, let me just quickly review. I think this is mm, like that. First one was middle because it was soft but was frizzy and it didn't hold that well. This one's going slightly up. There's more wave. There is volume. The hair feels a little heavier still a bit frizzy but I think if I'd put oil in which I don't want to do now um, then maybe that would take care of it or even a water-based um, pomade I only have a, um, a wax based one here so I don't want to be using that either uh, yeah so definitely there What I will do, let me just move the camera down a bit, sorry. So there you see, the curls are definitely there. There's a wave, more than there was yesterday. Still not perfect. And that was with um, Aloe First Spray for replacement of water. And then I used the L'Oreal waves three day heat protection on top of that and I've dried I let it dry on the sponge rollers for eight hours so I think this is good enough to go out for a day look but not for a glam look let's have another peek at the ends step on my little stool again so there you see I think for day wear this would be fine but not for not for a really glamorous look so not quite there so I give it a mm, getting there so that's challenge number two <laughs> so I'll I don't I don't think I need to video this tomorrow morning because this will definitely still be in tomorrow morning um, unless I see tomorrow morning that it's improved in some way or another then I will put a picture in so that was challenge two so Challenge three will be um, Yeah, I can try challenge three with just water and hairspray or I can move on to the John Frieda defining curls and water Or does one use water with that? I didn't actually read whether one does that on. Let me just look. I've got Phil Smith here as well. Um, let me just quickly read. Dream, yeah. Dream girls, curls, not girls. Curls styling spray. Uh, let me see. What does it say? How does one use it? It says on damp hair. So yes, so I have now an option. All of it is damp hair. So I have now an option. 
water and hairspray, whether that holds better. And I have Supreme, Supreme Stronghold hairspray. I have Flexi Hold hairspray. But I'm not going to use the so sleek hairspray. That obviously will <laughs> will not help. So not that one. So that could be challenge three. Or shall I do either one of these? Because the curly locks from Phil Smith is is used the same way as the John Frieda one. Um, this one, the Phil Smith is a lot cheaper than this one. Let me see, both are 200 mil, so they're the same size really. I prefer the ingredients of this one because it does have olive oil in it. This one has grapeseed oil in it. So I don't know. So shall we give this a go next? And then the fourth and then the fourth or fifth challenge depending on how you vote can be once more with the setting lotion um, maybe applied in a different way so that's down to your vote I'm relying on you vote for me and tell me what you want to see next and I will do it but I don't think I will be able to do this before next Tuesday, the recording. Uh, yeah, I think Tuesday will be the earliest I can do that. Okay, so thumbs up if you liked it, subscribe, and hit the bell button if you want to see the newest videos coming out. <laughs> Lovely to see you again. Hope you enjoyed this video. Bye. Uh, I forgot the other um, part of the challenge. I was also going to try, remember the flaxseed um, gel that I made, the conditioner? I th when I said, when I used it the first time, I said that might be good as a setting lotion. I was going to change that a little bit and do a as in a DIY setting lotion with that. So that would be the other option. So you can vote for that as well. And let's see how that works. I mean, why not? <laughs> huh. Yeah, let's try it all out. That's the most natural apart from the water part. Yeah, I think I'm quite liking that idea. So that will be most probably the last challenge because by then I think my hair will need conditioning anyway. And the thought of having that lovely rose smell again, that really excites me. So see you soon.